Hey guys, welcome to the channel. This is Mary with Segways. And today we are gonna be going over seven must have accessories when owning a Segway 9 Bot Max. All right, let's get into it. First must have accessory is going to be this Topeak adjustable water bottle holder. And what I have in here right now is a 24 ounce uh, water bottle with water in it, it's two pounds. So having the right uh, water bottle holder for your Segway is a must because um, some of the other ones that we've experienced, one, when going over bumps has either busted, the bottom's broken out, or two, when you go over a bump, this goes flying out and crashing, and then you're, hopefully you're not in the middle of the road, you're having to lock up the brakes, go get it, and it, it ain't no fun. So, I love this water bottle holder. My husband loves this water bottle holder. This is the one, our favorite. And um, the cool thing is the bottom down here adjusts. So, it, depending on, you know, what kind of water bottle you have, or um, maybe you have a smaller cup that you want to put in there, um, it adjusts. So, just put it in, lock it in, and tighten it. Um, and then the second cool feature of the Topeak water bottle holder is this adjustable strap. So um, depending on how, how big your, your water bottle is, you can uh, tighten it. So when you go over that bump, it ain't falling out. So this is the number one must have accessory. The number two accessory are these 3000 lumen LED lights. Um, the cool thing is they have three modes. Mode one and mode two are your brightness. So I think the second mode is where you get a little bit more bright. And then the third mode is flashing. Pulls right off and then the USB plug is right here. So you can plug it in and get your charge and be ready for your next ride. These lights are super bright. Um, the reason why we got these lights is because the factory light that comes with it it doesn't do the job. We've been on paths late at night and it was it was too sketch. So we needed something brighter, especially for me. I needed I needed to be lit up. So you may be asking, why do you guys have two 3000 lumen watt lights plus your factory light? And if you look, you can see how we have them positioned. So we kind of have it angled off to the side and then you have your factory light uh, right here. So the factory light lights up in the middle and then we kind of got these angled off to the side. So it really lights up the road or if you're going down a path, it really lights it up. So I'm gonna insert a clip right here. And that is why this is a must have accessory number two. The third must have accessory is this aluminum 360 phone mount. And what I love about it is your phone just slides in and you can lock it in tight. So if you go over a bump, it is not popping out and landing on the concrete, which is what we want to avoid. Um, so it turns to whatever angle you need it at. Um, and as you can see, the water bottles here, it doesn't interfere. Um, so it's definitely a third must have accessory. The number four must have accessory is this handlebar extender. And as you can see, we have our LED lights mounted to it as well as our phone holder. Um, and that is why this is number four must have. The number five must have accessory is our wild man bag. Don't you love the name? <laughs> uh, so we got, I believe this one is the three liter. There is a little bit smaller one than this, um, but we found that we need the biggest one and it fits perfect on the, the scooter. Um, so, and it has lots of room in it. You got a mesh pocket, um, you got 
uh, another pocket another pocket and you kind of got the middle now my favorite feature because you're gonna have keys on you I would assume <laughs> um, but I like this because if you open up your bag and you're digging around and your keys fall out you're in big trouble so this is like my must-have inside this bag so if you get a bag make sure it has a key holder so your keys ain't getting lost um, but this bag is awesome and uh, we do pack a lot of stuff in it and that's why this is our number five must-have the number six must have accessory is this kryptonite u-lock right here and uh you just pull it off i don't know if anybody has these but kryptonite is a really good brand for protecting your ride and these things ain't cheap so you want to make sure that you have the best locked and this is a peace of mind if you're gonna go out to dinner the movies wherever you're going or maybe you're going to work um, so kryptonite's a must and me and the husband are actually uh, thinking about upgrading this lock to the bigger one um, just so it's easier to lock up at a variety of different places and the number seven must have accessory is give me a moment while I break this down so I can show you <laughs> and I do want to point out that all these accessories that I've gone over, you're able to break down your scooter and everything's fine. Now, keep in mind, you do have to kind of adjust these, turn these so they're not bent as well as your phone mount if you have these accessories, but it is broken down and locked. So here's the number seven must have accessory. One of my faves and it's a new addition. This handle right here so you can take it into the office or we've even taken it into a restaurant and stuck it under our booth so we didn't have to lock it up so it is and it has like kind of a cushion on it which is nice so it's it's actually a really nice handle so that is why this is the number seven must-have accessory and if you're still with us, I have a bonus must-have accessory, especially if you're gonna be doing late night riding. I have a LED running vest um, and it's also reflective. So let's say you're out and about and the LED stop working, you still have the reflective part of the vest, um, which is cool. So you got your clear lights on the front and you got your red lights on the back and uh, this is a three mode vest. So if you're on about, uh, put this in your wild man bag and be safe out there. We don't want nobody getting uh, ran over, side swiped or hit. So this will keep people from uh, taking you out because none of us want that. All right guys, so thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys liked the video. If you guys enjoyed this video, check out our other videos of us riding our Segway nine bot maxes around. All right, well that's gonna conclude this video. See you guys later and we're out. <laughs>